All right, how's it going, everybody? I figured I was going to do this. May as well make a video showing you how, because I had a little bit of a problem while trying to replace this. So my GoPro camera, you can't really see it, but I have a little chip in the outside lens, and I'm going to show you how to replace it. So pretty much you go to GoPro.com. I haven't found a store locally that uh, sells the replacement kit, but you get this called the wide lens replacement kit. I know there's like a flat lens or something. I think I might try and get one of those, but I think I have to order that offline. So the kit comes with this little screwdriver that take it, get it the hell out of here because that's might be the worst tool I've ever used in my life. And then these are two like uh, O-ring gaskets. Comes with two lenses and uh, these case like protective thing and some new screws. I'm probably going to use the new screws because with that new that screwdriver that came with the kit, total pain in the ass to use to unscrew because you can't get like any grip on it because it's so small somehow i found this screw screwdriver laying around the house it says on it it's a i don't know if it's coming through it says it's a number zero i don't know if that'll help with numbering anything but it's just small enough to work what i was thinking about getting was a like an eyeglasses uh screwdriver because maybe that'll fit but any small enough screwdriver that'll fit that'll work get one of those so i tested it out i unscrewed a couple of screws so you're gonna want to Unscrew it. Here, yeah, take it out. Ugh. But I don't know. GoPro is pretty cool. It's definitely an awesome camera, but sometimes do some stupid stuff with it, and it's gonna get scratched. But luckily, they thought ahead and made a replacement kit. I would like to get the flat lens because. When uh, recording underwater, I believe, the flat lens is supposed to be a much better quality, I guess it would make turn it out to be while recording underwater. But to get that, that's going to be another video. So, the lens, remove that. That looks like it's still good. There's how to get the lens. Where is it? Right there. Pull out the lens and the rubber gasket. And I don't know if uh, you kind of sort of see the scratch that's in there. Some of it's like fingerprints, but may as well just use a new gasket. Use all the new stuff. So let's take out the lens. So that's the lens. I'll put that right there. Put on the new gasket. And I believe there's like, I don't know, I think you can tell. There's like a little raised area in the center. You want that facing up. So we're gonna fit that on. Put the lens on it. Put the, probably should make sure there's not anything around the rubber gasket or the lens case. Just make sure the Seal is pretty good. Put the, put the case back on. I'm gonna use the new screws because I'm pretty sure I stripped some of the old screws trying to get the stupid, uh, use that screwdriver that it came with. And I even looked up a video on uh, online to make sure I was I was like wasn't doing anything wrong and. It's just a screwdriver. It's not, I, mean, I guess it's a free screwdriver or whatever, but definitely would have been easier to find a screwdriver by myself, which wasn't even that much easier because I did not have a small enough screwdriver. Luckily, I found one. So after all, it worked out. And I guess GoPro knew I was going to go through some trouble somehow. Or they somehow knew it was going to be my birthday soon. And they sent some stickers along with it. So that's pretty sweet. Now I'm really hoping I get this seal tight enough. Because tomorrow I plan on going fishing. And I'm going to test it out. Now I finally get to make some uh, fishing videos. Without the <laughs> scratch in the lens. So that will make that look a little bit better. This one... But it's 
pretty good uh, replacement kit thing. 20 bucks. Not that bad. Plus, you get two of everything, except for the screws, which shouldn't need two of, but use that screwdriver. Probably going to strip the screws and going to need the extra ones. So, I guess it's lucky they did send them. That one. Now, I'm not going to tighten them all the way for the video, but you can see new lens on the outside. Pretty sweet. Pretty pumped. Can't wait to use it. Hope this is helpful to someone. Thanks for watching.